Hey everyone, today we're starting a series on TypeScript. And in this first video, I'm gonna to try to answer two questions. The first is, why TypeScript? Why would a Vue developer want to learn this language? And second is, if you wanna learn it, why should you use this series and not one of the many other series that are out there? So why learn TypeScript? There are two big reasons that I can see. First is that more and more teams are switching to TypeScript or at least slowly moving their project over. And the barriers to adopting TypeScript with Vue are slowly going away, such as in newer versions of Vuex, there will be a better TypeScript inference. And so the things that made it difficult in the past are slowly getting less and less difficult. Second is that even if you don't want to write TypeScript in your project and your team hasn't chosen that, there are more and more open source projects that are using TypeScript. For example, Vue 3 is 96% TypeScript and it's not easy TypeScript. So if you wanna dig in and debug anything here, you're gonna to want to know the language. Also, Vuetify, the number one UI component library in Vue. It is 41% TypeScript, and that's just because the rest of it is HTML and Vue, which I think is also TypeScript. I don't know how GitHub does this. As you can see, only 3% of it is JavaScript. And also the Nix version of Vue Storefront, which is the most popular PWA, Progressive Web App, headless front end for e-commerce. The Nix question you'll be asking is, all right, you wanna learn TypeScript. Why this course in particular? And the short answer to that is that this course is meant for Vue developers. This is TypeScript, the Vue parts. What that means is that we're gonna be taking the massive number of cool TypeScript features and just focusing on the ones that you're gonna see most often in Vue apps while completely ignoring stuff that's rare but common in other types of TypeScript apps such as classes and decorators. In addition, we'll be seeing examples of what we learn in the source code for Vue Storefront Next and Vuetify and maybe Vue 3. I'm hesitant to include Vue 3 core code because it's pretty different than most of the Vue code you'll be writing. It's essentially a compiler and very few of you are going to be writing compilers. However, I will say the TypeScript does make it easier to read. I can follow it not great, but much better than if it was written in just regular JavaScript. The last reason to choose this course is because it's paced for someone like you. You are an intermediate developer, but you haven't written any TypeScript before, so it's gonna move faster than the typical beginner tutorial, but it's not going to assume that you know a dozen functional languages or typed languages or anything like that. So for intermediate JavaScript developers, and it'll be a great lead in to the course I'm gonna create in the future, which is building a Vue 3 app with TypeScript. So if you're ready, go ahead and go to the next video where we're going to install and run TypeScript.